Hey guys, welcome to 2019. It's your girl in the P, and obviously I'm back with a new bullet journal for the new year. Yes, we're getting our lives together for the new year, and I just wanted to come on here and show you guys my new spreads, my new journal, and um, my new trackers um, that I'll be using for 2019. Um, so obviously this is the Lystrom, I think that's how you say it, the Lystrom 1917. Um, dotted notebook and it is the metallic edi edition and it is the bronze color or no copper it's the copper color and it's um a hardcover medium a5 i'll put the link um of where i got this on amazon um if you guys like this color so you guys kind of know how it starts off um you know you put your name and everything in there which i never fill out because it's always with me it's like my phone i'm telling you once you get a bullet journal you are addicted addicted to it just a few blank pages and then have um your indexes which i didn't use last year and i don't think i'm gonna use this year either so i'll probably just use this as like you know jotting down notes or quotes that i hear or cool stuff that um i want to look at or search or whatever i'll just use these pages for that um, and then we get into my little spread and it's not the best job, <laughs> but it says 2019 and just, um, little designs there. Um, I'm happy with it. It's not perfect, but you know, Hey, I was, uh, I'm getting myself together with the whole bullet journal process. Um, and it's cool. I like it for now. So welcome 2019. And then obviously I have my future log and I have, um, all my birthdays, important dates, things that are not um, changing. Um, also like, you know, information about um, my car inspections and things like that, um, that I'm go going to need to know for the year. So this is the second half of the year. And if you look here, this is kind of how I did my lettering. Again, not the best, but from a distance, it looks really good. So there's that. <laughs> And these are my favorite pages so far. Like, how cute. So anyways, these are my goals for 2019. Um, it's nothing really to hide, but like, you know, they, they're they my personal goals. So that's what's going on. And then on this side, I think it's the cutest idea. I will tag the Instagram person that I saw do this. I don't think she was doing it for books that she... Um, will be reading or anything like that she kind of did it in a different fashion but it's kind of like when you go to the library and you check out books like old school fashion and you can um do the little um checkout cards like back in the day i put the title and the author there and you know any notes that i want to remember about the books of course you know i'm not going to only just read six books so i'll probably just like fill it in um with more but yeah that is what i have going on there and then this is kind of like the money spread. Um, so I have a new savings challenge. If you saw my last journal, um, I did one. That one was a larger dollar amount, but um, which was really hard to achieve. Um, but so this year I kind of took it down a notch and um, I believe I found this on Pinterest. And rather than just keying it in, I just printed it out um, because I didn't mind the colors on it um, and um, attached it onto this page. And then I have just a few small um, credit cards that my goal will be to pay off this year. A good quote by, um, I believe it's Dave Ramsey, debt is normal, be weird, just a reminder. Um, so yeah. And then my next two pages are my mood tracker. I did this last year and really, really enjoyed it. It just makes you take stock of like... How you feeling and you know throughout the day knowing that I have to I usually do it at the end of the day by the way um, knowing that I have to fill this in it makes me want to like turn my days around and aim for you know the happy joyful <laughs> color to uh, fill in the box so 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 far so good not a bad year I've been you know saying average and happy so that's what's going on and then shout out to Latoya forever um, I have both she's tough and she's tougher programs so I will track, mm, mm, mm. don't don't judge, but yes, I will track uh, my workouts with her plan on this page. And yeah, I'll um, also, besides coloring it in, I will 
um, kind of make note of what type of um, exercise I did do for that day just to track my workouts and it feels so good to see all you know the check marks and you know progress you're making so I did this also last year so I will except with not as much detail but so I'm excited about tracking that and I will be working out after this video god willing <laughs> And so onto this page, I have this, uh, it was kind of like mm, a tough page for me to fill because I really didn't know what I wanted to do here. But then an idea came to me um, on Sunday about kind of just reflecting on 2018. That was what I originally intended this page to be. So it did work out eventually anyway. Um, obviously it's not done. I don't know how I want to letter these three circles. Um, but anyways, it'll be kind of like a reflection page and a look forward page, reflection, look forward and um, memory. Um, so yeah, I'll also link where I got this idea from and this quote here. It says, no matter how many mistakes you make or how slow your progress, you're still way ahead of everyone who isn't trying. So, yep, this is just a reminder page and I love it. I love how it turned out. I'll put probably a few more flowers just to fill it out. Oh my gosh, y'all, my battery's dying, so I'm gonna try to finish this. Um, so then I just have my month opener page. I have a calendar, um, and this was also rushed, so I'm not really sure how I'll do February, but it just says Happy New Year here, and, um, and so the adventure begins, and then I just have some important dates, Happy New Year, birthdays. Um, and some goals um, that I have for the month. And I'm not happy with this spread, so I'm gonna move on to this current week. Um, so I have notes here of things that I need to get done. I have my dates filled out, um, some notes about things that I need to do. I planned out some meals. Um, we'll see how that works out. Um, but yeah, then down at the bottom, and I did this last year as well, I just take quotes that I feel, that stick out to me. Um, so I will, continue doing this and I just get these little stickers from Walmart um, I have my daily gratitudes and then um, expenses so I want to do that this year is just tracking some expenses so let me know how you guys are doing your bullet journal if you started a bullet journal I highly encourage it it keeps you accountable to yourself you're taking note of like your moods your yeah I just think it's very important to be mindful of your goals and you know a good way to um, keep it all together is in your little bullet journal so let me know what you think of my spreads my um, trackers any ideas any suggestions and yeah all information will be linked down below with links of where I got certain ideas and yes thank you for watching I hope you guys are having a wonderful start to your 2019 and I'll see you in my next video mm -hmm, nails <laughs> bye